Buonasera a tutti, ma non lo devo dire in italiano perché voi comincerete a abituarvi a questa trasmissione in inglese, quindi good evening to everybody. The second time we are uh, broadcasting this transmission, yeah, I think it's the um, only Italian transmission that are broadcasting yes, uh, an English conversation uh, this time. Yes, I, that's a, they, everybody are saying it's a good idea to, to do this, but it's a good idea, I think, uh, not only for the uh, just to to have an English uh, conversation, but uh, also for uh, the topics we, we are going to uh, talk about, uh, speaking about uh, uh, next this time and next times. This time uh, we will speak about food and wine, and uh, we are hearing people uh, chatting, talking uh, at this table because, uh, as usual, uh, we are meeting uh, to to have a dinner and to speak English uh, at a restaurant, restaurant uh, La Nuit in Perugia. We are broadcasting from uh, this place, and uh, uh, our group. Uh, is composed by uh, many, many people, and every time we are um, ten and, um, and more people speaking about English. This time our topic uh, will be uh, food and wine, as I said before, and uh, uh, with a surprise for the um, component of the groups and also for uh, the people that are here now. And uh, we will have uh, a first try uh, of um, a Etruscan dish, an ancient Etruscan dish that uh, uh, we have um, made uh, for this occasion. But uh, uh, to start, I have to ask our uh, people, our components of the group, uh, what do you miss the most uh, about food for foreigners and uh, what uh, do they like the most? for Italians about foreigners' dishes. So, we can start. Say it again. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How many minutes do I have to answer? Think about it. Okay, okay. How many envelopes? One, two, or three. Think about it. Okay. Okay. Uh, so, uh, I have to ask, uh, what do you uh, miss the most? Of American food. Oh, American food. I think the most I miss is American breakfast. Uh, okay. Yes, bake, bacon uh, and eggs, this kind of thing. Uh, okay. And, and uh, yes. What, what, uh, what about, yes, Italian breakfast? Well, it's very light Italian breakfast. There's not much to it. And some, something sweet, maybe yeah. a small thing. Italians don't eat that much uh, in the morning. I'm used to a big meal for yeah. breakfast. So that's yes. what I, the only thing I miss. Right? Yeah. Uh, otherwise, the, the food in Italy is really much better than what I'm used to in the US. Yes. So I don't okay. miss too much. Okay. Yeah. Yes, what a style of eating, you know, the, yes. the big breakfast. Yes. yes. Uh, thank, thank you very much. Sure, sure. So, and, uh, and uh, Antonello, uh, what's the uh, foreigner dish do you like the most? Uh, the most oh, yeah. is the cookie of people of uh, what's my favorite dish is the the sweet of Christine. It's a cookie, <laughs> apple cookie, very very nice. It's English. And this dish comes is a sweet and comes from Cambridge. Very very nice. Okay. 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 Uh, I have to ask the the others. So. Hey. What, what's the foreigner dish do you like the most? 
uh, I, I like uh, sushi. Uh, you favorite I like sushi. Part of sushi. Oh, yeah. uh, I like uh, fish and chips. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. It's, a, it's a, a meal that I used to eat when uh, I went to London. Yeah, and uh, and sushi and, uh, and, and uh, no. kebab, yeah, um, very good. Okay, and uh, another American person that uh, will. Are you speaking? Explain. Are you speaking to me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah so what, what What do you miss the, the most? About home? Yeah. Uh, not very much anymore because you can find everything here. Yeah. Even American breakfast you can find here. Okay. So I don't really miss it the way I used to. So there's nothing. What I what I do like about here, uh, that's what you wanted to know, I think. What I like best about here is maybe polenta with sausage or um, fresh bread or um, let me think, cheese. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, so now I have to ask you to reach me at this place because I I can't um, have, yes I think that the right the right images uh, around the table. So uh, Marina, uh, if you if you come here, we, we can uh, we can see you. Okay. Okay, what shall I do? I miss most when I don't know. Swedish meatballs. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. No, no, no. It's not like that. Uh, what do I miss most? What I like most of this yeah. foreign. Uh, for joking, I would say the Swedish meatballs. <laughs> you can eat that in Ikea. <laughs> and um, otherwise, Chinese food. Uh, Chinese food I like very much. Yeah. Yes, because because in Italy, are you able to um, to to have uh, the real Chinese food or not? Not with the same taste. I not lived there for many years, and yeah. I know exactly, you know, the real taste. How does uh, it how it is? Yes, because so they, here is always something. You know, it's not really the same, but the same. you can okay. find nice restaurants where you have this Chinese, or even mm. Japanese is the same. I like Asian food a lot. I mean, I've been missing, but you can eat it here. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay. Dean. Hello, hello, Swedish hello. meatballs. <laughs> <laughs> Dean, from, yes, from Wales. Yes. I, I have no idea what what the, uh, the food in, uh, in Wales. Um, I would say the food in Wales is um, fairly um, uh, poor food in the sense that it is um, um, uh, a lot of country produce, so from the farms um, and very, very seasonal based. Um, it's only now that uh, a lot more um, uh, international uh, cuisine arrives in the, the country that we um, we have Chinese and Japanese food we have uh, Indian Malaysian Mexican food from all, all over the world and I think uh, my favorite and uh, the one that I miss the most is probably a curry uh, an, uh, an Indian curry and uh, something spicy something very very hot and um, the one thing about the Italian food is you don't get quite the same spice quite the same yeah. kick and um, I suppose that's the, uh, the, the food I, really, I hunger for uh, the most and I do try to cook a curry myself yeah. um, but I'm certainly in uh, uh, no um, uh, uh, doubt that the, uh, the Indians and the Pakistanis really do know how to cook a good curry. <laughs> okay, thank, thank you, Adi. No problem. Okay, um, now, are, 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 are arriving pizzas and other dishes and uh, uh, you can uh, see uh, what we do, we usually do, we are eating. <laughs> and uh, meanwhile, the discussion, discussion is going on 
Now, Cristiano can uh, uh, say us what, uh, what do you yes, like the most about foreigner dishes? Yes, uh, uh, perhaps uh, some cakes. Uh, the one I like the most is. Uh, uh, and, uh, an Austrian Alpine cake, uh, the Strudel. Yes, because uh, I like uh, the taste, I like the, uh, the dough, I like the ingredients. Uh, 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 part uh, sweet, uh, 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 fruit, fruit. Yes. Okay, and uh, and then uh, you can try our Tuscan yes, the dish, our Tuscan cake, and uh, uh, guess the ingredients. Yes. The components of the group will uh, do. Uh, yes, I think in, in a few minutes. Yes, you anticipated that yes, some ingredients are the same yes. uh, as the one of the students. So I guess I will like it. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yes. On the, uh, and now. Yes, yes, yes. Um, yeah. Another person from okay, UK will. Uh, okay. <laughs> well, <laughs> we'll explain what. Uh, what do I miss? Yes, she missed the most. Well, I like to, to, to try. To like Mike, I miss um, an English breakfast. Similar to an American breakfast, right, yeah. the sausages and the bacon are not the same here. They're very yeah. good here, but they're not quite the same. Yeah, I know. But also, we have an awful, a lot of foreign food in England. Not so much, well, there is British food, obviously, but a lot of foreign influences. So I miss, like Marina said, Chinese food. It's not so good. Yeah, Japanese restaurants are quite good in Perugia, but not Chinese. And yeah. Greek, yeah. Greek, Greek, Greek. Food. Yeah. Uh, uh, There are some yes. ingredients I can't, and, uh, we can't like buy. Bread. Yes. Uh, yeah. we so now, in Perugia, we don't have uh, so many examples of yes, foreigners' no, restaurants. No. And you don't need it, you see, because Italian food is so good. Yes. You don't think, oh, we must find something, something new. Yes, something but, uh, uh, oh, yes, but uh, I think it's useful to compare in some way our cuisine with other cuisine. And uh, uh, our it's um, easy to have a good food when you have a good ingredients. Yes, of course. Yes, yes. of course. Yes. 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 When I was um, yes, in Bologna, but I was um, abroad, I experimented many of these restaurants, yeah. Yeah. such as yeah. such, also yeah. the African yeah. restaurants. Oh, really? Oh, yes, oh, there is a very, very, in Bologna, there is a, there is a very, very good um, yeah, restaurant from uh, Ethiopia. Oh, yes. If you yeah. have the, they they do a very very particular okay. dishes. Oh, that's and, uh, something I've never tried. The, well. Yes, the, the boss <laughs> said uh, that uh, he was able to have uh, many of these Indians directly from Africa because uh, yes, uh, because he said as, as you said before uh, in Italy we don't have all the uh, Indians for no. for no. for the dishes. No. 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 So he was able yes, to, to have this. But uh, okay, uh, now we are eating Italian food. Indeed. Yeah. And uh, as I uh, said before, we are going to experiment a uh, yes, uh, very particular dish. Yes, I'm looking forward to okay, it. Okay, okay. And uh, uh, I'm sorry about this uh, because you are, you are eating, you, are, you all are eating a uh, salad. Food now it's and uh, savory, food. savory food. Okay, and uh, the for the transmission is for is for the experiment. We have to taste uh, uh, a sweet food, and uh, I know that many foreigners are um, yes 
used to yes <laughs> i used to to this not not italian yes mixing yes yes but uh, uh the very interesting thing is to to guess what the ingredients are because uh all these ingredients are uh i think uh, yes i'm sure uh, that were present at the Etruscan age, mm. 3,000 years ago. Mm -hmm. And uh, this will be the occasion to um, just to know and promote again this uh, product, this produces. And uh, some of this, um, I am just Justifying, yes, that there are uh, produced here because I, I did. Mm. Yes, <laughs> I did yeah. it. I did. Um, so I'm growing in the in my uh, yes, uh, the father's farm. Okay, uh, thank you, thank you very much, Christine. And uh, and now uh, I have to ask, uh, yes, for some. Uh, so for, for some place from Piero, okay. I I I'm, I have to ask uh, Cristiano if uh, yes, yes if um, uh, <laughs> ask Piero from for some place, dishes, plates, yes to just to taste the best dishes. Okay, um, now we will have. Um, a very very little uh, slice for each of you and each of you uh, will uh, say will say will yes wonder uh, what the ingredients are should we write them down uh, yes <laughs> <laughs> <Check them out. laughs> so um, uh, then i uh, i don't know what's the price will <laughs> for yes in our slice so no an entire an entire pie yes, oh, no. <laughs> for for them no yes i um, okay like to give piero the first go yeah yeah yes yeah, so we will ask uh, Piero, uh, the uh, yes, the owner, yeah. the, the boss of the restaurant, to um, to try. For, yes, and uh, now uh, I have to to show you what the pie are like. Uh, okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> so yes, it's difficult yes to to guess uh, only only watching it. Yes. Th thank you, Piero. Yes. It's Piero. It's Piero. Pizza? No, 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 no. You have to, you have to, yes, to taste, to try, to test. Uh, <laughs> yes, the, the first, and uh, and say what what do you think are the ingredients? Okay. Yes, and. Uh, if the experiment will be successful, we will find this recipe at the restaurant in the, in the menu. Yes, you can sit down. Okay, the first bite for for Piero. It's expression. Molto buono. Okay, it's, it's saying it's, 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 it's Okay, honey, honey. Equilibrata nel sapore. It's balanced. The flavor is balanced. Okay. Faccio una foto a Piero. Okay. Se si vuole comprare la macchinetta, il telefono va bene. Ehm
Okay. We are waiting for his judgment. Sto studiando. <laughs> Sto studiando. Okay. È una composta di frutta. Yes, they are fruit. Tutte con prugni. Yes, sort of, sort of, sort of. Speciale di persichini. Pernichini. Pernichini. Okay. Pernichini e lagune. Okay, so, honey, sort of plum, there are pernichini as a particle of fruit, okay? Jam, and, uh, jam of pernichini. Pernichini. And then, noci. Yes, walnuts. No. Wow. Nocciola. No. No. Uh, mandorle. As almonds. Mandorle. Almonds. 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 Finish, bro. Un moment. Okay. Now, now, yes. The, the first, yes. I, I, I think he, he, he got. I think uh, four, four, four of the ingredients. Yes. That, yes. Kind, kind of ten. There are ten. There, there is one of these ingredients very, very important. Ingrediente very importante. More, very important. Yes. Miele abbiamo detto. Yes. Honey. Poi per frutta, poi... Walnuts, almonds. Anice no, no. Anice no. Non no. c'è perché non c'era anice. Un sì. pan di Spagna non c'era. So. Yes, the, the, the base. Yes, the base made. Yes. Qual è? Made it. Flowers, okay, but I, I think this is, uh, yes, the uh, other uh, people can guess other ingredients. If you, if you, if you, if you, if you, if you give them a little slice to each uh, component, they, per ognuno, per ognuno, e dei che guess, 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 Yeah, yes. Would you like your particular like you yes. yeah. so trying um, of this. Again. Okay. Meanwhile, I have to uh, explain you what what the uh, next program will be about. Uh, we are planning uh, in some way a uh, sort of of. Uh, Grazie. <laughs> um, so, yes, sort of promoting of local producers and the local products uh, from Umbria, uh, because there are uh, so many producers and products that there are uh, very, very high quality uh, brand, but uh, are not so known uh, around all around the world, uh, all over, over the world, because um, we are many times uh, confused with Tuscany uh, economy, uh, but uh, we are sort of a particular uh, zone uh, um, producing uh, uh, ancient uh, legumes, ancient uh, uh, meat, ancient uh, such as canine, ancient leg legumes such as Pagiolini uh, Trosimeno and uh, other products uh, part very, very particular, but uh, uh, also uh, particular recipes uh, made of uh, these ingredients and uh, very, very good wines. But uh, uh, I think the very important thing to say is that uh, Umbria is the place where there is, uh, I think, yes, for, uh, for me, uh, for, uh, for my uh, taste, uh, is the uh, best olive oil in Italy here and uh, uh, the reason I think is that uh, we have a particular 
some particular species of olive trees, such as the agoja trees. There are uh, nowhere in Italy, in, uh, in, 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 any, in any region, there are um, some particular yes, species, but only in Umbria there are these particular uh, species of olive trees, the agoja trees. In particular, uh, they are in the Trasimenos um, zone, Trasimenos valley, so, and uh, around the lake. And uh, uh, this kind of olive, uh, I think, uh, makes uh, the flavor um, sweeter in some way and uh, um, smooth, I think, at, at, the, uh, at the taste. Okay, but uh, uh, this is to say that uh, we'll invite in the future uh, farmer, um, companies, uh, and uh, all the uh, people that uh, will be involved in this kind of uh, promotion. And uh, uh, every time we will um, link this, um, this produces with uh, a particular wine, a particular oil, uh, to uh, yes, to to show uh, the possibilities to, to and, and to know what the uh, Umbria economy offers now. In it. Okay, but uh, we are yes testing now the. The Tuscan, the Tuscan cake, Tuscan. Uh, I, I, I have to ask you uh, how we can name it. If it's a cake, it's a sweet pie. Uh, I don't know because I, yes, I, I think uh, for uh, mother tongue uh, people, it will be something particular. Try it. And uh, um, yes, I'd like a tart. Yes, maybe a tart. Yes, because Cristiano, Cristiano are saying yes, volumini cake because volumini uh, was a um, very important family in Perugia, a Tuscan family, and uh, uh, their tombs were discovered, uh, I think, yes. Uh, 50 years ago in Ponte San Giovanni yeah. and uh, yes in English could be St. John's Bridge yes the place where uh, the, the tombs were discovered very very important for their uh, shapes and uh, it uh, uh, it's like a sort of um, subway uh, yes a uh, Underground. underground town. Uh, yes, they um, <coughs> carved it on the, on the rocks, and uh, it's uh, uh, like uh, yes, a, a town. And uh, they uh, when people entered first time this this old town of Trascan in uh, Ponte San Giovanni, um, they. Uh, had the impression uh, people were living there because it was perfectly as yes, the age of a Tuscan and uh, uh, nothing was changed in the, in centuries. Yes, in, in yes in millenniums, uh, no, not, not centuries. And now you you can visit it and uh, uh, in Porto San Giovanni and uh, many of these uh, tombs are are in the Etruscan Museum in uh, in Peru as well. Okay, we are yes serving the the sweet pie. Some of them are testing 
Uh, okay, I I know, I know. I <laughs> know. I think there is a liquor. Non c'è tipo un liquore qualcosa, there is something like No. No. Not exactly. Yes, yes. Right. So I think that the the um, mm. pastry has been dipped into liquid. Must be some kind of liquid, liquid or qualche tipo mm, di No. No, it's not like that. Yes. Mm. Yeah, yes. Davvero? This is the flavor, yes. Uh, something, but I, I, I can explain you what. Uh, that is what is making it uh, different. Some flavor. It's the flavor. I cannot guess what it is. Yeah. The first, first taste. Yeah. For me, even too sweet, so to speak, in a way, but it's good. Mm -hmm. Molto dolce. It's very sweet. Yeah, but yes. this has been dipped into something, or has been has absorbed something. Absorbed, yes. Yes. If you come here to restaurant La Nuit, not the, only this time, but next time, you can... You can yes, something, yes. It's like wine un, or a syrup, uno sciroppo. No. Wine. Some uh, the, vino, special wine. Special wine? Special wine. Ho okay. vinto, ho vinto, ho vinto. Okay. And uh, what's the particular wine that uh, are in this zone? And there is, uh, and they, uh, in the past, as and the, the same name as in Tuscany. Passito. No. Is, is red wine? No. Uh, white wine. Uh, sweet. sweet wine? Sweet. Vinsanto. Vinsanto, ecco. Vinsanto. Okay, it's another ingredient. A flower. It's a flower. Yes. But there's also like, 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 like ricotta, ricotta, ricotta cheese. Ricotta cheese, good. Ricotta cheese, but but what particular ricotta cheese? Oh. Goat, <laughs> cabra. No. Where do you see ricotta? Oh, this white part, this ricotta. No, yeah. just just yeah. White. Yeah, it's the white part is ricotta. It's about the very very particular ricotta. I don't know. Oh, from, don't know. From? Guess the animal. So from a sheep. 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 Oh. So how, how many ingredients are we up to? How many have we got? Uh, I think but there are... Yes, we have... Uh, okay. Uh, because... Yes, vermicchini. Yes, as we have said. So to to sum yes Sugar. to summarize yes uh, we had um, uh, walnuts mm -hmm. almonds mm -hmm. uh, ricotta cheese from she mm -hmm. uh, pernic yes okay pernic uh, mm -hmm. jam uh, vinsanto mm -hmm. and uh, yes and I think the other yes only yes and the other ingredients I think are about the the base yeah, yeah. it's a flower and uh, yeah. the other ingredients no I don't think there is any flower <laughs> no. did you make the pastry mm, no I have to yes to say <laughs> yes but I, I, I Sponge, right? Yes, but uh, I think it, uh, I it it could be yes made also uh, as a tart, hmm. as a tart. And in this case, I had to use uh, panikini jam. But uh, if we uh, were in summer, we uh, could use uh, the fresh fruit. Yeah. So the yeah, also. 
to oh, me it's a little bit too sweet my taste mm. okay so i think it should be it should be some uh, yes if you, if you use yes fresh fruit and and not jam yes they are uh, less sweet than uh, than it yes, but i think it's it's, a, it's for, for, my, for my for my taste it's, it's not so you can say it's really um, fresh like um red it's not uh, industrial you know like yeah yes. yeah yeah i have a question yeah. Where did you find the recipe? <laughs> yes. Okay. Um, okay. Grazie. Thirty, forty <laughs> years ago, <laughs> oh, when I uh, was. I want peace, peace, peace. I bring it to Carlo. <laughs> okay. And, uh, Carlo eats that. And, uh, <laughs> they, they have eaten their pieces, their, uh, uh, their, their dishes. So uh, they can have other slices of, of this cake. Uh, oh, yes, right. if, if, they, the if, they, if they What's want. The and, uh, and about about and, uh, and Catherine is uh, yes asking for for the recipe the and uh, mm, it's a long story okay. and uh, uh, there is uh, no uh, an exact recipe for this cake because um, uh, I had uh, 30, 40 That's years enough. ago yeah. about uh, a particular. Sweet pie that uh, uh, was named uh, Pruvia <coughs> or Prugia in the zone from uh, Orvieto to Città la Pieve, Ficulle, Fibino. This is zone. This was uh, in Etruscan zone in the past, a very important Etruscan zone. And uh, they, they uh, made it with, uh, I think, uh, Yes, Pernicini, because they called it Pruvia or Prugia. That oh, is, yeah. it's it it come from uh, comes from yes, uh, Prugna in Italian. Yeah, yes. it's and uh, the it's Italian close. and the Prugna in this zone, plums in this zone, are uh, Pernicini. That uh, are the uh, ancient trees of Etruscan people. They uh, brought here from Caucasus zone as the other fruit trees uh, they, they they brought in Italy at their times uh, and another uh, produce they uh, introduced in Italy uh, was yes wine because uh, Venus is an Etruscan name and uh, now we are um, growing Yes, grape. Yes, uh, grape trees. Yes, with the as the Etruscan did at uh, the time. It's a particular um, form, uh, kind of yes, uh, of this that is uh, called um, cultiva in Italian. It's cultivazione spalliera. Yes, the, the, sa the same, the same, the same the Etruscan did, and uh, it's. It's not exactly for the olive trees because uh, the olive trees was introduced were introduced in Italy um, by the uh, Greeks in the south of Italy, and they uh, after that yes after the um, Puglia, Sicily, uh, Calabria in the past after that they spread everywhere in Italy, especially in. Uh, in Amber with, with the Tuscan people as well. And uh, this is important, not only for the food, for the ingredients, but uh, um, also for the um, um, for the landscape, because to, uh, to have these uh, produces, they transformed the land. Yeah. They um, had a particular cultivation in uh, our hills that uh, was called um, a terrazza, terrazzamenti. Uh, in English, we can say uh, terrace. 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 And uh, every uh, hill was uh, sort of carved, sculptured uh, with this uh, particular um, uh, terraces uh, because they uh, needed ground. To, to have these trees spread everywhere. It's olive trees and uh, uh, grape uh, trees. And uh, now I have discovered uh, some of these ancient trees in my 
uh, in my farm, in the farm of my father. And uh, I'm trying to uh, to have uh, a new cultivation, a, a new uh, nutrition, a new crop, a new crop, a for, new crop. For, for this. Uh, this, um, this jam you are eating uh, from uh, three trees, I have in my farm. Are you growing them? Spalier? No, 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 no. no. The trees, the trees are, are like yes, plum, plum trees. They are big trees. And uh, uh, now I have uh, many, many of these little trees. I have obtained by by seeds. So we can have the uh, biodiversity. Uh, for uh, these trees, as in the world, are uh, asked. Uh, yes, uh, they, they want now. Yes, to, to, to have everywhere. Yes, for for our health. Yes, to and for the health of others. And now I have to ask you if you have. Uh, if you have loved, <laughs> yeah, I, I would say all the rest. Uh, we bring it home, so it's okay. Yes. Yeah, it's very, very healthy. Yeah, it does. It feels healthy. <laughs> yes, yes, because this is a concept of organic food, because all the ingredients uh, that are in this uh, dish uh, could be grown as organic here. Mm -hmm. In Ambia, and uh, the particular uh, thing is that uh, uh, many of them are, are trees. So we can um, we can have um, many fields that are not uh, used now. Yes, the uh, word yes to to this um, uh, produce in the future. If you, if you want, yes, we can, we can have a, a project about it. I, I have a project about, about it, yes. And um, so, uh, what your impression? What, what are you? Is there is also honey on this? Honey? Yes, yes. Yeah, we said that. But there are not so many uh, quantities of yes. any. But honey is also making it very sweet, no? For, yeah. For, for, for Yes, I think next week if you can do the same again, I think everybody will be happy. Yes, no, ne 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 next time we, uh, we will have the broadcasting, uh, the transmission, uh, we can try uh, the uh, some food with some wine, so we can invite uh, some winery or uh, yes, local uh, farmer, and uh, we can uh, taste their produce. So uh, we can ask them also how they are producing uh, this this kind of products. Yes, oh, I think oh, organic food um, is, is very important to the um, olive uh, production, olive oil production, and um, a lot of the Francoyas, the, the, the mills, are very um, proud of the fact that um, they produce organic uh, yeah, um, uh, olive oil and um, and if this is, uh, as you say, uh, truly organic, then um, I think it could be a hit today. Um, a lot of people uh, want that um, uh, security in where the products come from. Yes, and to know where the products come from. Yes, this is. I I, th I think it's the. Uh, yeah. I think you in England uh, say you have uh, eat the nail. Eat the nail. Eat the nail. Eat the nail. Because because uh, I think uh, there are many many publicities now that are saying uh, their produces their products. Are good, are organic, um, yes, blah 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 blah. So, so but uh, uh, nobody <laughs> says um, or show how they produce it. Don't be And uh, 
I think uh, people need to know uh, and to um, to know yes, all, all the, ch the chain, the food chain, to to be sure about this part. Yes, I I know it's not. Uh, say, we in Italy have, we have the possibility to, to do it. It's uh, not. Yes, in uh, all over the world. Yes, there are not the possibilities to have um, this organic food. But uh, I think the important thing is that the people uh, have the possibility. Yes, to uh, to choose. To, yes, to uh, to know and decide what uh, they will eat. Yeah. Uh, tomorrow. And if they want to pay a premium for a premium product. Yes, yes, because as you say before, yes, the uh, many, many uh, farmers uh, could produce it in an organic way, but now it's very, very difficult, it's hard because of the Yes, the prices. The, the commercial, the commercial. Um, reality. Yes, <coughs> yes, that's right, because they have to produce a crop. Yeah. Um, because most of the crops are pre-sold. Yeah. So you have to produce a certain amount of uh, notchy, for instance. But uh, if you don't, then the, the buyer can't find the products from elsewhere, so uh, there is an expectation that you have to produce uh, a quantity. Yeah. Uh, so now I have uh, a little test for you because we have um, uh, talked about yes the recipes, Italian and foreign recipes, and uh, uh, we have uh, tried. Uh, the it was just by the the Prusa or Pruvia, and uh, now bye bye. I have to yes, to say you. to say goodbye to Cristiano. Thank you. Bye. Next time. Ciao. And uh, Ciao. Ciao. now Ciao. now I, I want to know uh, if you uh, if if you know the ingredients of some of your uh, favorite recipe uh, your, your dishes. Uh, yes, it, what's the uh, main dish in, in Wales, for example? Uh, the main one I can talk about yeah. would be a dish called cowl, yeah. which is a lamb-based um, stew, uh, oh. um, which uh, involves potatoes, leeks, carrots, um, and uh, the, the lamb and uh, water um, and that is cooked um, usually for 12 maybe even longer uh, hours so that um, the lamb is, is boiled in the, uh, in the broth and then um, served to very hungry people. <laughs> okay, thank, thank you. I, thank you, I, I know a traditional Welsh dish. Yes, and uh, uh, do, do you know a part of our recipe? Yes. 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 A recipe? Yes, from the United States. Well, there is a dish from my uh, part of the U.S., which was uh, improvised, uh, and it's a, a fried chicken wings yeah. with a hot Tabasco sauce. Yeah, and uh, it's usually eaten with sticks of celery and a blue cheese uh, salad dressing. Yeah, and uh, they refer to them as buffalo wings. Maybe you've heard of them in Europe. I don't know, but it's become popular throughout the U.S. because it's a small snack food. It's just a small chicken wing. You eat them one at a time with your fingers. You dip in the uh, blue cheese uh, dressing, roll for cheese dressing, and you have a piece of celery with that. And it works yeah. perfectly. I have to confess. I I, 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 I I never tried it. Yes, but I am very. Why are they called buffalo? Yes, because they came from buffalo. Buffalo, yes. yes. Because buffalo don't have wings. <laughs> buffalo don't have wings, right? The chicken, it's they're chicken wings made in buffalo. Many but there is a, a story of how they were invented. Yes, because because, because yes, if you if you are uh, talking about yes recipe, we discovered that uh, also recipe have their 
stories. Yes, that is stories. No, sure. Yes, this is. Yes, I know the story of this one. Yes. The um, yes. The, the creator it's of the part, uh, part of the human. Uh, yeah. Yes. Uh, it's very uh, recent. Pleasure, very yes. recent. Nineteen seventies, maybe. Um, uh, there was a family that owned a bar in Buffalo, New York, and the son of the family brought his friends over after the bar was closed and asked the mother, do you have anything to eat? She said, well, I just have some of these leftover chicken wings and this and that, and, but I'll fry them up and put them together. So she just kind of put together things that were handy and, uh, and every week the, the friends would come back and say, hey, mama, make more of those chicken wings. and. Sure. So she put them on the menu, and it became now it's a national uh, snack national food. Snack. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, uh, yeah. Uh, yes. Story. You know the story? We 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 were supposed yes to uh, to, to speak about also wine, but uh, you are yes we have no time this yes to to speak um, this time about food and wine, and uh, I think. Yes. Next, next, next time. Cheers. 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 We will uh, speak about wine with producers. Yes. So, uh, so it will be yes, a very, very. Study before something. We must begin so, to get prepared. So, Catherine, uh, another recipe you you, you you like? Yes, from the United States. I've been away too long. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I, I know you are expert on uh, Jewish... Jewish cooking? cooking. Not, yeah, okay, I can tell you one. Huh? We, um, my, my mom and my grandma used to do a lot of uh, stuffed cabbage, which is cabbage leaves, which are boiled and then stuffed with meat, chopped meat, and rolled up and cooked with... <laughs> yeah, um, cooked with um, raisins and tomatoes and vinegar and rice. We used yes. to have that a lot. Yeah. yeah. Not in, it's not my favorite, but it's something I remember. Yes. Oh, so, so in Italy, there are many examples of a Jewish recipe and there's yes, oh, yes. Roma, yes, uh, yes, Florence, Rome, Florence, Florence uh, Ferrara, sure. every town, every part, sure, sure. Part, part of But they're from different countries. Yes, well, yes. So, well, this, so is the, Polish, think, this is mostly Eastern Europe. Uh, yeah. There are also the Spanish influence. Uh, so totally different kind of cuisine that I know. Yeah. But here, I have my favorite foods here, you know, Chinese. Um, <laughs> not Italian, but Chinese. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Now, we have no now. more time. No poetry, no wine, no more time. No more time. So I have to uh, say goodbye to goodbye. to everybody. Goodbye. And uh, I I goodbye, goodbye Pi. <laughs> I hope uh, there will be others uh, transmission to yes to explain you uh, what are you what are we are enjoying. Yeah, and uh, food, wine are only a part of what we are um, really enjoying in, the, in, the, in this case, because um, you can uh, see how we, uh, how we discuss, how we are involved in this, uh, yeah. all, all this topics and uh, uh, I think yes. it's uh, better no, than, uh, uh, than uh, stay in front of a uh, yes, uh, uh, TV uh, <laughs> match. Yeah. That will do that <laughs> match. Yes, I'm saying this because uh, meanwhile we are uh, just doing it. Uh, there is a uh, very, very important, yes, football match, I mean, yes, very, very Which is why hardly anybody came to the but, 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 but I think um, uh, we are learning uh, things, and uh, we hope uh, everybody is watching it, are uh, learning as well. Yes. Thank you, and uh, uh, see you, and uh, hearing from you, next time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye. 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 Bye.
Ok. 